What's up? We're back again. Recording some Minish Cap. Uh, yeah, yesterday I uh, thought, why not? Just go with the John file a little bit, and I did. Just to go ahead and get the feel of the sword play and all that. It's pretty much easy and all that. Come on, Evan, let's hurry to the castle. It is only... 10 in the morning. Oh my god, it's a weekend and... Oh, what's this? This is beautiful. It's like a little bridge. Yeah! Do it. Yeah! There you go. Yeah! Hit! 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 Yeah! This must be the business scrub I heard the soldiers talking about. They were saying a duke of scrub had been hassling all the passerbys. Evan, do something to boot it. Otherwise, we can't get to the castle. If only we had some way to defend ourselves against those nuts of ease. Well, well, princess, since you got me this very little shield. No! Can this hurt me? Why are these not? Ding! Yeah. Please forgive me, sir. I heard there there was a festival when I came to town, hoping to hawk my wares. Well, unfortunately, we scrubs have a tendency to spit nuts when we speak. Everyone got scared and ran away, and no one would buy anything. This is a terrible place to do business. I'm going back to my cave. Makes you feel a little sorry for the business. Okay. <laughs> Enough voices for this video. It's too early in the morning for voices. I feel a little sorry for the business scrub, but that not hurt. Well, yeah, I bet. I mean, fucking hit you right in the face. Oh, well. He won't be hassling anymore now. We better hurry to the cast cast aisle. Can you roll, princess, huh? Huh? Can you roll? Can you know how to roll, huh? Yeah. Oh! Evan, you brought this. <laughs> Sorry, did you? Then, as the master to the kingdom of Hyrule, I puff to accept this blade. You came just in time. The war ceremony will begin soon. I'm sorry, Evan, but I'd better go. I have to prepare for the ceremony. I had a good time at the festival. Thanks for coming with me. Oh, She left me alone. Since you're here, Evan, why don't you join us for the award ceremony? Oh, look. Oh, there's the Master Sword or the Skyward Sword. The Skyward Sword, I think. It looks more like that. Do you know about that sword, Evan? It is called the Picori Blade. And it looks much, looks much evil way in that chest. The Picori Blade is sacred among them. People of Hyrule, the legend has it that long ago, the Picori gave us this blade. Whoever wins the competition earns the honor of touching the sacred blade. Again, music from the, the uh, Nintendo 64. Or well, it was. Fatty, champion of the competition, you may approach the blade. <laughs> Sorry for that. <laughs> His laugh always got me. To think things would go this well. The Picori Blade and the Bound Chest spoken of in Hyrulean lore. The chest must hold that which I must take a relieve you of its contents now. They're like, oh, hand no! Yeah, 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 we'll stab you! And then you're like, no! You got some far shit, man! Ha ha ha! Ma ha ha ha! Do not interfere with me. It's Victor. I thought your name was uh. No, never mind. I've <laughs> earned the right to approach the Picori Blade. I've been waiting for this moment. Come here, come here! Oh God! Who are you? Why are you doing this? The princess who holds the power. Okay, the power of light. 
The strange power is said to flow in the veins of every royal lady. You've been friend ever since the day from the gift of your people. If I leave you now, you'll only cause me trouble later. Oh, God. Two stone with you! Yeah, yeah! Oh! Oh, my God. She got turned stone. She's so stoned right now. Ha, <laughs> ha. Hey, 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 hey. All who stand in my way shall share this fate. Now, to find out what power awaits me in the chest! Huh? There was nothing in there, my little mouth. It wasn't in the meaning of it. Oh. And it wasn't in the meaning of it. It wasn't in the meaning of it. Oh, God. Oh, that, that voice is painful. Sweet giblets, it's only five minutes in. Oh, I'll be awake, up. That was me like five seconds ago. Oh, Eben, you're awake. Are you feeling all right? Stand on my side. The King of Hyrule is about to speak. All right. Hey! <laughs> it is as you have all heard, a man named Vati has cursed my fair Zelda and turned her to stone. She is a princess, right? She is not your fair. Yeah. If we had the sacred Picori blade, we likely could have broken the curse. The Vati shattered the blade. However, I have not given up her blah blah blah. I'm sorry, she really looks so upside down. I am sure the fairy tales. Yes, the same. But the Picari are not mere legend. They most certainly exist. This is the most speech in the whole t whole entire game, I think. So, just bear with me in this episode, because I will get to action in this. The family knows the truth about them. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but look look at the fucking professor guy. He's like, Look at my mustache. Ah, uh, look, there's my mouse in the way of the video again. God, you know, I'm gonna stop doing that. They should be able to repair the broken blade and reforge the sword. Oh, well, what? They must dispatch the soldiers there at once. No, soldiers will not do. Of course, I do not show themselves to anyone but children. The soldiers can search for days and still not find any sign. Oh, God. Oh, God. I, I, uh, in that case, I'm like, oh, man. Oh, I accepted a broken sword. I you got the Smith sword, it's your blade, made by your grandfather. Very well then, send the soldiers to search for Betty. Here, deep within the minish wood, you will find a place called Deep Wood Shrine. Um, I think it would be best if you started your search there. Take this map with you. If you get lost on your way to the forest, simply check your map. It's best start the left trigger or right trigger to open the map. I've marked the location of the forest for you. Good luck in me. You got a map of Hyrule! I love you Wow, that's an awesome map of Hyrule. Look, four squares. Oh, he said I was counting on you, Vadia. Um, I'm counting on you. I'm counting on you, Eben. God damn it. By the way, my name is not Eben. It's actually John. It's something else, but whatever. You'll see it on my profile page. I don't have to explain this. Only you can break Vadia's curse and free Princess Zelda. Awesome. So basically, we're in bare bones right now. For we 
can't open these doors, and I've been playing some Metroid, so I keep expecting that if I hit the door, it'll open, so... So we can't really do much right now besides head to the first dungeon. Like that, there's my small shield and the smith sword. Here we go. So Minish Woods is right here. I think that we're going to enter from, um, we either enter from right here or right here on this bridge and then we have to go through these trees and, yeah, I can't remember. It's like, what about all these other locations? So I need to go, bam, I need to go sideways. Never mind. Let's get the shit on the road. Ow! I'm too I'm hiding my dreams! Guerrilla Warfare! Okay. No. Dude, ow! You son of a bitch, why would you do that? Ow! God, I'm just getting torn up. I got one dollar! Who leaves all this change just laying out here? It's like... Jeez. And again and again and again and I played just about every game in the series except for Skyward Sword and that's okay with me because someone told me that Skyward Sword sucks balls and it's not worth my time, not worth my time, my time, my time, my time. Hmm. Yeah. The only reason I didn't play uh, Legends of Skyward Sword is because I, I, I don't have a Wii anymore. So, cause like I said, my cousin sold it. Because you can't trust him. Like, it's weird because there's literally no respect or trust in this world that we have today. Because, uh, yeah, I can't, like, like I said, one of my cousins sold that, just up and sold it. And, I mean, there's a reason behind it, but, I mean, what, it's not anything that I want to share, really, but he, he was buying something that's not good for your own health. This is Lon Lon Ranch, by the way. I thought you would all like to know that. Oh god, I'm gonna eat you, Octorox. I'm gonna chop you up and make you a steak out of you, because I'm hungry. I could eat an Octorox. Going too far, am I? Bitch. Bring it. What? What? Do it. Do it. Just do it. Do it. Go ahead. He wouldn't even shoot at me. What a puss. Ow! I'm already dying. Oh god, this isn't good. I'm already dead. Do 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 yeah, so, like I said, we'd enter at the bridge, we'd come through here, please forgive the beat, the heart noise going on constantly. Bleep bleep! 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 Watch, watch my treats! Okay. Ow! Why? I didn't know that that would hurt me. Give me a heart, damn it. All I want is a heart.
Why do you know? There's no such thing as a heart in this neck of the woods. Well. Huh. Anyway. Next time we come back, we will check out the Minish Woods. And see what it's all about. So, every single one of you have a good day. And I'll be right back in the recording.